Saturdays, Saturday and Sunday. Katina. Thank you so much, Michael, and don't go anywhere because I'm going to need you in a minute. Well, the Mississippi Highway Patrol is already gearing up for the holidays. MHP second annual toy drive for Blair E. Bats and Children's Hospital is currently underway. And here to tell us more about this event is coordinator John W. Pace. Welcome to Midday, sir. You know I always love having you on because you are from McGee. But what you're doing is especially wonderful this year. Tell us the history of this event. Well, the history of this event is everybody writing into the toy page said, are you going to pick on Katina again? And I picked on her last time for taking me to a gas station for lunch. <laughs> Let me tell you, when you do that, you don't get taken anywhere for lunch. You got to learn them sometimes, so, not teach them. You got to learn so them. So I'm not picking on her today. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna <laughs> to pick on a weatherman over there. Uh, this is the second year for the toy drive. The last time I was in here to talk to you, we were talking about the kickoff October 26th. And my favorite stat that we have already, last year we had $32,000 in toys and, and cash for the hospital. And we are prepared to deposit 16000 after day one. Wow, that's so, amazing. So we've kicked it off. It is going now. Um, I wanted to touch on some of the different types of toys right quick. Sure, and, and go right these, ahead. What do we have here? I see one thing that I really like. I love the fingernail polish. I actually need my nails well, polished. I'll get and to done that today. in just a second. Okay. Whenever you say that. toy drive, the first thing people oh, think gosh. of are toddlers with their trucks and things you got like that. So, uh, oh, <laughs> Michael Haynes is a Bama fan. Okay, I read anyway, that. Uh, this is not the only uh, the children that they're being treated there. Uh, range in age from birth to 18. Okay. So, one of the things that they fire yes, for, for the, the smaller ones. kids. And that says, my LSU Tigers play Bama this Saturday. Fires for uh, the LSU fans oh. after the game oh, Saturday. No, I know he did not go there. Tell, tell me he's not Mike. <laughs> I'm trying to do good here. That is the ugliest tie ever. Uh, <laughs> Wait till you see the real Alabama tie. They have Friday. children from that age to. This is fingernail polish. This is for the Bama fans. Okay. We bet fifty dollars in toys for Batson on the game. Yeah, come on over, Michael. Okay. So that's how this thing got started. Me picking on Alabama fan. Trooper Jamie Puckett uh, is a big Bama fan. He founded all this, so I came to pick up here. Brandon Artilles. About that red, the crimson with that LSU. You did notice that, that the, 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 the toy purple drive there. shirt that he has on is purple for LSU and that the crimson tie, tie is going That's on. Right. This is one of so many. These two have actually made a bet concerning this game and this toy drive. Gentlemen, tell us about it. Well, uh, Brandon got mad at him because he got beat. So Brandon got on my side. Sure. For this weekend's game, but if you win the bunch, you have the same bet with other folks. Toys, take it out with toys. We've got toy locations all around the metro area. I want to mention that uh, we have Fillmore, uh, Buick GMC is one of our main sponsors, and I also need to throw in that our good folks at the Mississippi Department of Wildlife, Fisheries, and Parks. Very quickly, so here's how this works. Since Michael is a Bama fan, if Bama wins, then you have to donate $50 worth of toys. But if LSU wins, then you and Brandon are going to chip in the 50 bucks, or do I have that backwards? Straighten it out for me, gents, really quickly, because we're almost out of time. 50 each mm -hmm. if, if it's me and Brandon. And It'll be hundreds because I bet other Bama fans. But LSU is going to take care of business Saturday. Right. And uh, right. for Toy Drive locations, go to Toy Drive for Batson on Facebook. And the phone number is 601-506-2395. These are fine folks. And so glad y'all have Brandon's us. already had to wear a houndstooth for me this oh, season. That's, I mean, a, he's, that's the only time. He's going down a rough road. road. Look, all I'm going to say is what you say every morning when we cut the uh, mic off. Roll tight. <coughs> Roll tight. <coughs> Roll tight. No, that's <laughs> go Tigers. Excuse We're me. back in a moment, everyone. Kind of cold this afternoon. <laughs> go LSU, right? I'm staying out of this one. <laughs>Okay, so uh, John Pace, with this bet that you gave me, brought me a shirt, and he actually bought me a red one, which could be considered crimson. It's almost like he's trying to put me in the middle of the bet with to you say guys. Something? I think I uh, you wore a crimson outfit Friday that may could be, uh, it's within the amount of right of time that you're not repeating it. You can wear it this Friday. How about that? <laughs> and, you know, he brought you one, and he brought Brandon one, and he brought Gaylene one. He was just sure. taking care of us. It's for a good cause, right? Crimson Friday. Great weather at the end of the day? Oh, yeah, looking, looking nice. Going to be a little breezy, but warm. Uh, rain tomorrow night. Have a great day, everyone.
Now with the new Mississippi News Now mobile app, you'll never be without Mississippi News. From msnewsnow.com to text and email alerts for breaking news and weather, Mississippi News Now, it's all right here in the palm of your hand. Sponsored by Mississippi Blood Services. Donate blood to save a life. 